Hey guys, starting off the vlog. Uh, what was this? I got the meatball thing, sub, whatever. Uh, we had breadsticks and I got fries. And they got pizzas and cows in And tomorrow I'm heading to the lake early and I'll catch y'all then. Fast my exposing bullets. We're uh, at the bowling lanes. Fixing the bowl a little bit. If you don't want it to get banged up, Joey, put it in the back. There you go. Hey guys, fast bike bows and bullets. It's early. I'm tired. I'm going to the lake. See y'all later. Finally here. This guy's starting to turn. It's hard to see on camera. There's the lake. Y'all can't see nothing. But hey, that's the lake. As you can see, it's a bit lighter out. Lakeish. Into the back pond now. At the back pond. It's still dark for y'all, but it's light outside. It's hard to see. Eh? Turn it up a bit. All right. Anyway, all the crap around the edges of the pond is dying. I guess these like it cools off and it kills it all. I mean, it's late October. But it's the 29th, actually. Same. Uh, it's supposed to be 80 degrees tomorrow, which is Monday, November 1st. 80 degrees in November. Alright guys, I got my spook, which is a, I got a new one because I lost my, uh, one of my mystery tackle box, which was a, what was that? I don't know, uh, but this is a, like a dog junior, uh, KVD dog junior or something, walking dog. And I'm um, gonna get to fishing. I also bought a catfish pole here. So, yeah. Throw this out with some dough ball. This used to be a pay lake, so hopefully some big ones in here. Alright, guys, it's plenty of daylight. I threw this spook around for 45 minutes without a single bite. So, I guess that means the water's cooled off enough that they're not really going for top water. So, I'm gonna slip switch to something more finesse, probably a jig or something. Alright, guys, threw the jig about 45 minutes too. Going back to the spook, I saw couple bass bust. Slow morning. Not much going on. Still no bites on the catfish pole either. Alright everybody, this guy, I got him. He's barely hooked. Skin hooked there. Not a bad fish though. Real long, skinny. One sec guys. Look at this fish. Skinny, skinny, skinny guy. 
Get him back in the water. Sorry, bud. He just barely took it under the surface. I thought I had a branch or something. Ugh, he needs some food in him. He's skinny as a rail. Got him in this little thing over here. There's usually a, just a couple stacked in there. Swim up this creek and they chill out in here. And then that tunnel too. Let's do over there and there he was. Alright, first catch of the day. I tied the spoop back on. The jig didn't work out, so. Yeah. Alright. That there's a beaver lodge, right? And that's a moss frog. And there's a stick going to the beaver lodge. I want that moss frog. Be right back. Alright, yeah, that's not happening. Frogs are gonna stay there. I think that's a bouillon pad crasher. I don't know. That stick started sinking when I stepped on it. If I had my boots on, I would, but I had to walk here this morning so I didn't bring my boots. I'm not walking a mile in the old mucks. So, yeah. Got the booyah pad crasher on the beaver dam. Because I snagged his line, which ran out over in the water. So we cast it from over by like by that pipish area. And I cast it in this little thing. Right in there, if I can sit my finger. And I snagged his line. So, now I'm just going to chuck this frog. It's not good enough. So I grab the line and get it. Now i got to get back on this skinny little thing that could easily break. It's probably not a good idea to have my phone out right now. Because I could just drop it in the water. Which isn't good for electronics, for those of you who don't know that. I'm a junk. Oh my god. Oh, that's cold. My foot went in the mud and sunk about a foot. Right there. Alright guys, I just threw this frog around maybe half an hour. Now I'm nibble on the catfish pole. I'm going to reel it in and check it. But, I'm having a hard time figuring these fish out today. I don't really want top water. I caught that one fish, but there was like back in that cave and he just nicked the back of it. I think it's already too cold out. So I don't know guys. I have to figure something out. That jig didn't work either. Might have to dig deep into my box, pull something out. Alright guys, I just threw around the spinner bait for about half an hour. Not even a nibble. Got absolutely nothing. So I have to go deeper in my boxes. Thinking maybe a worm or a jerk bait. I don't know. Chatterbait. What do y'all guys think? Chatterbait? Would they be eating a chatterbait right now? Maybe. I don't know. Probably gonna have to go to worms. You got things, frog trick worm? Hey guys, it's been about two and a half hours since I last checked in with you guys. Bite's dead back there. I can't get nothing. I came up to here, I got these rigged up with catfish. Some of this stuff. So, just in here maybe. 15 minutes, no bites yet, but my friend will be here soon, so yeah. Just chilling. Alright guys, he's got this nice fish. Little uh, channel cat here. No, this is a blue cat. Yeah, that's a blue cat. That's a blue, yeah, that's a blue cat. Not a channel cat. Nice little guy. Uh, ate the dough ball. He crossed my line, so I picked it up. Because uh, that, and then when he got it off, I actually had a fish on it, and it, it popped off right there when I tried to lift it, so let's get the release. <laughs> Alright, let's get the release. Ooh. I might catfish. Huh? I might use catfish. Yeah. You get this here dill ball stuff. Alright guys, been out here another two hours. Walked over 
there. And uh, I hope my friend who has his pole tangled up and uh, some guy over there. He's not there anymore. We rode in a five pound catfish on my pole. Yeah. But other than that, it's been pretty quiet for the last two and a half hours. Yep. Alright guys, it's been about an hour since I last talked to y'all. I am walking to the back lake. Fightless for the last hour. I might try to catch a bluegill. And try to throw the spook some more. Man. It's about like 4.30 right now. Got here well before sun up. Long day. With only two fish. A little catfish and a little bass. That's still it. Man. Alright, I'll see ya. Ooh. Add another fish, hopefully. Alright guys, just left the lake. It is 5.22. So, got there like 7. Or got there about 8. Left 7. Walked all the way here and then uh, started fishing. Alright guys, just uh, got home. Made dinner. And uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, and uh, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you at the next video.